Ladies and gentlemen, today we are talking about trading on the internet and how the role a government can play to facilitate those SMEs to do business with each other in a global setting. Internet is a magic for most of companies because now with the help of internet, you can access to any supplier or customers around the world. And in the past, it was almost impossible for you to do any business with them. So let's go to the internet, because on the internet is full of opportunity for the SMEs. What kind of opportunity? Let me try to make a, an example for you. Can you recognize what this animal is? Well, for people, who come from South America, you probably can recognize that it is an alpaca. Do you know that in great China areas, most people will recognize this animal as a grass mud horse, or in Mandarin, Cao Ni Ma. Cao Ni Ma is a very popular figure in Taiwan, China, and Hong Kong especially in youngsters. It is recognized as a magical animal that represents the spirit of against the government ruling on the internet. So people love this animal a lot. Maybe for people who come from South America, it's just alpaca. But for Taiwanese people, it's totally different animal and it means a lot of different things for us. Now, this means the meanings of Chao Ni Ma in Mandarin is just like the F word in English. Since it represents the spirit that youngsters want to against the government control of the internet, the youngsters actually worship the Chao Ni Ma here in Taiwan and China. So when you go to internet here in Taiwan, you will recognize that a lot of people are actually selling alpaca-related products. And all these products are labeled Chao Ni Ma products in China. Their youngsters worship the Chao Ni Ma so much, they even write a song for it. Do you want to hear it? How about it? Do you see Taiwanese people love Chao Ni Ma so much? If you are an SME who is selling alpaca products, think about it. If you can sell your product to Taiwanese here, then probably it will create an incredible business opportunity for you. Because here in Taiwan or China, you get a lot of potential customers who are more than happy to buy your product which is made from the real Chao Ni Ma. So the internet makes this opportunity available to you, while in the past, you can never access to. If you want your business to be internationalized, the first things you want to do is the global sourcing. That means you might want to import something from other country, or you can be others global source. That means 
you can try to sell or export your product to other country. Traditionally, global sourcing was considered a sourcing strategy in global setting. Its main purpose is to explore global efficiency in developing products, in delivery products or services. So with the help of internet, more and more business now try to outsourcing some product to the country that has lower labor costs such as China. Or another case is a lot of American companies move their call center to India because they can use the low cost English speaking worker in India. But nowadays, global sourcing is no longer limited to low cost country only. For example, in our previous story, Taiwanese people love Cao Nima, and people who can sell Cao Nima products are far, far away in South America. So if South America businessmen can sell their product to Taiwan directly, and then both parties will feel very happy on the result. And this, obviously, is not a low-cost situation. Why do we want to go global sourcing? There are three main reasons to do that. First of all, even you are small and medium-sized enterprises, but in today's modern world, it's probably a necessity for you to learn how to do business in any potential market in the world. Sometimes, you have to go internationalized because if you are lack of some specific skill or resources in your country, you can try to tap into skills or resources outside the boundaries. And in the end, some SMEs will try to find some global sourcing because they try to develop alternate suppliers or vendors sources. But on the other hand, since most SMEs are inexperienced and lack of resources, so there are some disadvantage for you to do on global sourcing. The first reason is that there are a lot of hidden costs associated with different culture. A small company from Peru probably cannot understand why people want to buy alpaca product from Taiwan. And the other risk is that you probably will put yourself to exposure to financial or political risk in different countries. And obviously, it will increase the risk in losing your intellectual property. That means when you try to sell something to other countries, the local company there might try to copy your idea. So, so you are actually risk on losing your intellectual property your know-how or your idea on that products. After you have considered the good reason and the bad reasons, most of the SME in the past might consider that international trading is such a professional job that cannot be done by themselves. So it belongs to those professional international trading companies. But Nowadays, internet has now changed the condition. Because now on the internet, you can find different kind of websites that will help you DIY the international trading business. Those websites can be divided into two different kind of websites. The first one is ePortal. For example, a customer in France can go to eBay and buy some product from a supplier from Peru. And there are many professional e-marketplace that they will match the transaction so that the seller and buyer from international tradings can come together and meet each other on a website. So with the help of those global sourcing related websites, now it's possible for SME to do international tradings by themselves. So started five years ago, 
Taiwanese government decide to start a campaign to promote our SMEs to go for the international trading. So with the help of those e-portal and e-marketplace, they now can directly sell their product to another SME around the world. The campaign, after five years of hard working, has proven it as a great success. Nowadays in Taiwan, more and more SMEs and businessmen will go global, globally to sell their product through the help of the internet. Let me here make an example for you. It's a bike company in Taichung. Its name is Ballistic Bike Company. Ballistic is a professional bike company. But just like most of the bike company in Taiwan, even though Ballistic is very professional in manufacturing high-end suspension folk and allo folk frames, but still no way for them to contact directly to their international customers. So the major business they can do is to do some outsourcing service for those big international bike companies. Even though they produce high quality products, they have to sell it in a quite cheap price to those big companies. So two years ago, Ballistic Bike decided to join our campaign. By using the internet, they try to sell their product to some other country in South America or countries in Southeast Asia. And it's proven to be a great success by using its own brand. Now people in those countries can recognize that Ballistic Bike is a low cost by high quality bike. So internet actually provide an opportunity for ballistic bike to connect with their real customer around the world. And now ballistic bike can no longer have to control by the big international bike company anymore. Ballistic bike company, their success on international market was depend on global sourcing related website. There are different kinds of e-portal and e-marketplace on the internet. In the next section, we will try to make an example for you. Most of the global sourcing websites are actually quite similar. So here, let me make an example using the most famous global sourcing website in Taiwan. That is TaiwanTrade.com. TaiwanTrade.com is, is an interactive e-business portal designed to provide small and medium-sized enterprises with immediate access to business-to-business e-commerce activities. So the purpose of e uh, TaiwanTrade.com is to encourage global SMEs to do international trading with each other and to help them to get digital aid age over their competi competitors worldwide. What is a global sourcing website? In order to provide their sourcing service, they basically use huge database for their international buyer, sellers, and their products. For example, in Taiwan Trade, you can find more than 1 million to 200,000 buyers and more than 90,000 suppliers and their products. On this huge database, it's very easy for you to find your potential sellers or buyers in order to sell or buy on these global sourcing platforms. There are three ways that you can sell or buy on the TaiwanTrade.com. The first one, if you are a seller, you can set up your e-catalog on Taiwan Trade. And if you are a buyer, you can go to the website and does some keyword search. So you will find out the proper products or a proper supplier for your, by yourselves. The second way of doing business on this website is to post on the online bulletin board. 
Usually, those websites will provide online bulletin board so everybody can post what kind of product they are trying to sell or what kind of product they want to buy. So online bulletin board will automatically match those sellers and buyers so that you can do further transactions. If sometime you try to sell some unique products or you try to find out some unique products, it's not easy for computer to do matching for you. So most of the global sourcing websites such as Taiwan Trade will provide search assistance for you. The search assistant is actually is a human processing system that can provide professional consultant for you. By asking you to fill out the form, those assistants will analyze your requirement and try to find out the best seller or best buyers for you. For some SMEs, when they try to do business, do their first international trading, in order to lower their risk, there is a very convenient function provided by most global sourcing websites. For example, in Taiwan Trade, you will find a specific area called Sample Product Sales. To buy products from Sample Product Sales, it's just like buying product from any selling website on the internet. You first browse the products that you want to buy. And when you decide you want to buy some of them, you click the button and you place the order. And the seller will ship that product overseas to you. But there is one thing different between buying from eBay and buying from global sourcing website. Global sourcing website are providing sample for your evaluations. And after you test the sample and you feel okay for it, and then you can place a real order to the sellers. With the simple product sales, you can lower your risk on doing international trading because you can always test it before you actually place your order. To further facilitate sellers and buyers on the internet, most of global sourcing websites provide newsletter service. They will collect sellers' information on newsletter and periodically send those newsletter to potential buyers. They also provide several space for sellers to put their videos for promoting their products or companies. So interesting buyers can go to the website to watch those videos. By watching, by watching those videos, they can further evaluate whether they want to do business with the sellers. Usually, global sourcing website will try to provide some unique service to sellers and buyers. For example, in Taiwan Trade, they have provided a free service called iMeeting. iMeeting is an online meeting service. It will allow you to talk face-to-face -face with suppliers on secure video conference platforms. Usually, the sourcing manager will have to interview you for your detailed sourcing needs and find su suitable supplier for your evaluations. So let's see how this service works. Let's watch the videos. Taiwan External Trade Development Council Taiwan Trade Free Online Trade Meeting Service do you spend a great deal of time and resources looking for the right supplier for your business? Now there's an easier way. For a convenient sourcing experience, try TaiTrust Taiwan Trade Online Trade Meeting Service. Taitra is a non-profit trade promotion organization backed by Taiwan's government and industry bodies. Taitra has over 60 branches worldwide, with more than 600 professional staff standing by to serve you. Taitra's comprehensive database is full of quality suppliers from Taiwan's manufacturing industries. All you need to do is tell us your sourcing requirements. We'll then put together a list of quality Taiwanese manufacturers and suppliers for you to choose from. It's that simple. 
Upon your confirmation of the potential suppliers list, we'll begin arranging meetings scheduled for you and suppliers. When the time comes, you can sit in the comfort of your chair and chat face to face with suppliers one by one, online and in real time. No longer do you need to book for hotels, go to airports, or make costly international calls. Since its inception a little over a year ago, Taitra's Taiwan Trade Online Trade Meeting Service has served over 500 buyers by matching them with over 5,000 quality Taiwanese suppliers. This exclusively customized service, brought to you by Taitra, will help you save time and money. And best of all, this service is free. Enjoy a peace of mind with Taitra's free online trade meeting service. Okay, periodically, Taiwan Trade will arrange group trading meetings for potential buyer and seller in specific industry or for specific products. So people who are interested in products, in the products, will come together and sellers and buyers will talk to each other like they have face-to-face -face meetings during a trade show. So with the help of websites like Taiwan Trade, the small and medium-sized enterprise can do business with each other more easily, easier in the global market. Now in Taiwan, we realize that there are so many small and medium-sized enterprises which can provide unique products for their potential customer. But because there are lack of channels to communicate to their real customer, so even though their products are great, but they have no opportunity to be recognized by their potential customers. But with the help of Taiwan Trade, for example, here in Taiwan, we have company which provide cosmetic contact lenses. With the help from Global Sourcing website, they have been successfully to sell their product to Africa. In the past, this is very difficult for such a small company to try to establish international tradings with countries in Africa. And another example is a company in Taiwan who manufacture beautiful and unique kitchenware. Now, they can successfully export their product directly to another SME in America. And their products are being sold very well in the United States. But in the past, again, those things could hardly happen. Because their products are so unique, and their customers are so far away that they can never reach. But with the help of the those global sourcing websites, such as Taiwan Trade, now they can grab the long tails in the international society. Thanks to the help from internet, now it's far more easier for any SME to do global trading with another SME in another country. So, let's go to the internet, because now internet is full of opportunity waiting for you. So, thank you for your listening. Thank you.